So when you travel by train, all you want is to arrive on time and to arrive in one piece. However, this is Clown World where there's an agenda around every corner. The headline says that the first UK train displaying the latest version of the Pride flag is being called a beacon of hope. And this is the train here. But worst of all, this pretty much came out of your tax money, but more on that later. Because look, I'm going to cut straight to the chase. As you can see, this is a train. It doesn't need any form of pride flag or any other flag for that matter. And genuinely speaking, if it is going to have a flag on it, then maybe it should be the British flag. It says that Trans Pennine Express said that its Unity train featuring the Pride Progress flag will be a beacon of hope for the diverse communities. And as you might be able to tell, I'm not one of them. But I really don't see what having a flag on the front of a train will do for anyone. Because it ain't going to help the 99% of the general public, nor will it help the less than 1% of the people that it actually represents. It says that it's celebrating a week of inclusion to embrace the individuality of both its employees and customers. This is according to the government-owned operator. So that really is the best part. It's government-owned, so it's government-backed. And I'm assuming that they do charge a ticket fee, but it really does seem like the rest of the money's just coming out of our pockets. And as always, before anyone says I'm anti this or anti that, regular viewers of the channel will know that I live next door to two women. And believe it or not, they don't actually have their entire house covered in pride flags. Honestly speaking, if I didn't know any better, I'd think that they were just friends. And to answer your first question, I'd probably say about 7 out of 10. And to answer your second question, unfortunately not. But I'll keep you updated though. So will you be riding on the LGBT train? Or will you be running in the opposite direction? And why on earth does Rishi Sunak want to check your bank account? So, thank you for becoming one of the 24,630 subscribers. Thank you to the channel members. And thank you for checking out this video on screen. This country has gone crazy.